Hey, sir, I just want to uh, make a quick video to show you, uh, you know, what I was talking about with uh, image recognition always on. Uh, and I got to tell you, for, first off, dude, this build is fun to play with. It's it's way stable. It uh, I, I'm, I'm able to see this stuff. It's it's I love this project. So thank you again. All right. Let me show you what I mean uh, by this one thing. So you'll notice I had to go into this lesson uh, and it's this is what it's trying to find, but I have to click this for it to find it. And I don't want to have to click anything. I just want it to immediately be on. Uh, so it found it. And now what I'm hoping for is that it tracks it. Like you'll see I move past it, but it's still flashing that area. So I'm hoping that the box will track with it. Uh, and if it doesn't have it on screen, meaning like this, this, this thing is rolled up, uh, if it doesn't have it on screen, um, when I scroll into view, it's going to find it. It's going to find it. So it keeps on looking for that. And, and as I scroll up and down, that box goes with the scroll. Um, this is an odd one, too. So this is, so see how it's finding point light here uh, and looking for cube. This is you see there there it goes it found cube now if you notice that it had a little bit of trouble going between these things and maybe you know if it keeps on looking for it it might have better results it seems like if i keep clicking it it has a better result on that second click it's like oh i found it this time so kind of an interesting little thing right there is is uh Maybe with this always on recognition, it'll it'll have better results. So if I click it once, it's not gonna find. I click it again, it's gonna go to the correct one. Kind of an interesting. Up oh, there it goes. See, it's like, oh nope, I found it. So it, yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, I just want to make a video. I figured this was easier to tell you um, than try to type all this, dude. Great work. Thanks.